What's up guys, Timmy here, and welcome back to the new video. So today, we are here in Nice and Dragons. We have 180 gems, or a bit more, 182. And today, we are going to be opening, right off the bat, over here, the limited edition chest to win the horrific bow mail plus version. So we are going to be going into a different account after one of my buddies' account and level up the plus version of the armor because he has it. And I really want to see this test. It, it is a pretty cool armor. I got other stuff to talk to you guys about, future projects and stuff like that. But right now, we are on my Android account. And as you can see, here is my armor. So I currently still have one Shadow Force, so the Sylvan is Stone Mill. And I have a couple of Dragon Forges over here. But yeah, five-step chest. Who knows? Maybe we could get something good First one, 14 gems. We're going to be getting one future soul and an epic. All right, all right. Tectonic. Skip this over here. Anyways, second reward. Not really that important. All right. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see an epic. But this is what is interesting. I'm not sure if it's the first time that we see this. But is it me or 32 gems? And you get three keys like that. That's a good deal, I think. That is a pretty good deal, as you can see. So we got two star future boost armor. That kind of sucks. But the champion chest over here, it is still a pretty decent one. Where are you? Yes, over here, champion chest. You see, we got one dragon key. So then, just from that, we got one for the 25 gem chest. So that is perfect, because we're going to be opening it later on. Then, from this, we're going to be getting another key. But it's going to be costing 50 gems for a legendary future boost. I guess that's going to be pretty good since our uh, Sylvanas uh, Shadow Forge Arbor. It is a Earth Adam. It's pretty old, but I only use this uh, this account for mainly chest opening videos. Last, but certainly not least, we're getting Ultra Rare. So many future boosts to date. Wow, that is definitely crazy. I did not think of getting that. I just wanted to do this little leveling for fun. But I guess if I do... Four, four star future boost. What is this gonna be giving us? Hopefully, this is doing at least. I want at least level 75 out of this. I was pretty close, pretty close. Level 76 out of this. So, that is some pretty nice stuff. But we are now going to be. Oh, 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 oh. I was gonna say go on Android. But I forgot. Epic. All right. Melstorm Irons. All right. Sensor. Get out of here. Get out of here. We're now going to be looking at the Enchanted Chess, blah, blah, blah. And now we are going on to my iPhone over here. And as you can see, we got a beautiful armor. Thank you to Ver for lending me his account. Really awesome. He has a ton of Shadow Forge armor. Some pretty cool armors, pretty cool stuff. As you can see, he got the Vine Horror armor. So the normal version of the Shadow Forge uh, crafting season. So the third one, I think. So as you can see, Van Horror Cures Plus version. So here is the Plus version of the armor. He just got it. It finished crafting. And as you can see, with the rings and amulets equipped. As you can see, where are you? Yes, over here. 4 out of 5 in session levels. And this one also. As you can see, the level 1 stats are pretty crazy on this Plus armor. I think they are really awesome. So 1,257 health. That is definitely one of the highest health that I've seen, and definitely the rings and amulet really show, as you can see, 242 bonus and 277. So it is really rings and amulet concentrated on that, and then 5,286 attack stats and 5,030 defense stats. I think it is some pretty cool stuff right there. So we are go definitely going to be going into the enhancing over here, and starting right off the bat on the beautiful armor. I gotta check, is it the plus version? Yes, I don't want to enhance other armors or so, so, lo, stuff like that. So we are definitely going to be starting into the two stars and then going on forward with the other stuff. We're not going to be using any one stars because honestly, who wants to see us use one stars? I do not want to see that and it's going to be too, too long. So I don't know if we're going to be able to max it in this video. He told me he had enough funeral boost so, and stuff like that. So hopefully... He was right on that one. If not, at least we can get it to level 50 or a higher level. <coughs> oh, sorry on that. I don't know why. I've still been a bit sick recently. I don't know. Kind of sucks. But oh well, we have to live and go through. So, I'm not going to be using the 3 stars. I really don't know if he wants me to use the 3 stars. So, that's why I'm just going to be doing the 2 star armors. We still have a lot. We have the uh, Exorcist one. This one over here. Where are you? Yes. We have like 20 of those, so that is definitely going to be pretty useful in the leveling. It is right now like level 20 or so, 
So we are going to be continuing doing this beautiful stuff right there. All right, all right, all right. Level up, I just tap on the screen and this makes it faster. So I had more uh, videos, ideas and stuff that I wanted to share with you guys. And I really love the, f the feedback on the videos, the comments. That is the best thing that you can do to support my channel. Just comment on my latest video where I got the free Shadow Forge. I'm pretty excited about that. Because even if it was level 1, I would still be pretty excited. But now that it's level 99, that has definitely helped me. Because since I just pushed, it would probably be hard uh, to level it up since I don't have a lot of fusion boost. But since I got a l already leveled up Shadow Forge armor, that is pretty cool. The video, you guys have probably already seen it. I posted like 1 hour ago. Well, I'm recording this video like 1 hour after recording the other one. And it's freaking at 1,000 views so far. So people are definitely liking it. Got a ton of comments, like already like 100 comments or so. We love the feedback. Some of you guys think that it's not fair. Some others think it's fair. And I don't know about that. I think it's nice that they reward some players. But I think it's not fair at the same time. So yeah, a bit of controversy on that. But mainly, I think it's just like the people that pushed that got it. I don't know. Because it doesn't seem to have uh, anybody that hasn't pushed doesn't seem to have it so i think it's the people that has pushed in the past few weeks that have gotten it apart from that i don't really know what i wanted to talk about is a bunch of different stuff while we are approaching level 50 i got a idea for a night of dragons podcast that i do maybe once a month or once every two months with a bunch of uh people that play knights and dragons other people that make videos on youtube on the game maybe a little podcast so it's going to be quite long. It won't have any face cam or it will have just if you listen to a podcast or podcast is basically just us talking. It's maybe be it's, it's going to be between one hour and a half and 30 minutes. So between 30 minutes and one hour and a half. So it's kind of long. It's at least 30 minutes. But it is going to be discussing us about the game. What are our thoughts on the game and different stuff like that. We can we're really going to go in depth and talk about pretty much everything that is going on into the game. Maybe uh, season four. Of the crafting materials and different stuff like that so that is pretty cool got other some more knights of dragons videos coming up pretty pretty soon and now we are into the crazy leveling with epic fusion boost and stuff like that it is right now at level 84 right off at the end and then we have two five stars over here i'm not too sure if we're going to be able to level it up to level 99 but i think so and i also got this thing it's not it's a vr box so i think it's kind of decent just like a random friend of my dad's gave us to give it to us he had no use for it and he got it for like 15 bucks or something like that it's really cheap it's not like a vr that you plug or anything it's just a thing that you put in your that you put your phone in so i'm going to be putting my iphone and then you adjust the lens and you really see like in virtual reality you don't have to hold it so i think it's nice if you guys want a like I guess a reaction video to some kind of stuff like that. I think it would be pretty interesting to do. And I have a ton of new stuff like to unbox and do stuff like that. So I think it could make pretty interesting videos. So enhancing over here. As you can see the beautiful armor. Oh, oh, oh. Level 88. Level 99. I mean. And now we have it over here with the ascension levels. We won't do any of them because I'm not too sure if he wants to do it or not. But still the stats of the armor are pretty pretty nice with no ancestral levels as you can see 6815 attack stats and 6441 defense stats with 1357 health so definitely the best thing about this is the health if you compare it to the other ones just uh, the uh, the thank you one the last one it is still pretty awesome with over 1069 but this one 357 it's just pretty beautiful. So you guys, this is going to be it guys for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to smack that like button for awesome Nighty Dragons and much, much more. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.